Good morning, friends. It's Tracy and Violet from Nova Scotia Living, and we slept in today for goodness sakes, Violet. Why did you have to keep hitting snooze? It's like 20 to 7. Oh, so I'm just taking her out for a super quick, you just have a quick <laughs> pee, and then we'll go back in, and then I'll take her for a more proper of a walk after. But for goodness sakes, I'm not going to be able to even have my coffee before I wake the kids up. What am I going to do? I'm going to turn inside out is what I'm going to do. But anyways, I'll be back. Just wanted to start the vlog. All right, guys, the bus came and we just made it. I'm telling you, we're all just a little off kilter today. So I'm trying to get them out the door without letting Violet slip out the way. And Misha's just taking her sweet air's time getting there, for goodness sakes. Oh, gosh. That was a whirlwind and a half. At least I shoved some breakfast in their face out the door. <sighs> All right. The kids are off. Marquise is about to leave for work. I see, I had a wet cream on my face. Um, I see Mar Maze forgot his glove and gloves and hat. So when I go into town, I'm going to pick up a big box for the Christmas cozy, I'm taking the truck. I'll swing by and drop those off at school, but I'm just sitting down in my coffee now. I need to do that before I do anything else. I did go wake up Mally though, so hopefully she'll get up. All right, it's eight o'clock on the nose. I stayed up late last night. Didn't go to bed till almost midnight. I think that's why we had such a hard time getting out of bed. But I did another like book haul kind of thing. Those books right over there. I was sitting right there at that wall, but these are all Christmas presents. Oh, Christmas presents. Not all of them, but I wanted to get a jump on wrapping presents. Usually I really enjoy wrapping presents, but this year I just feel a bit behind. And I know it's only, well, tomorrow's December. So, you know, I just don't want to have to worry about wrapping a bunch of presents with a house full of kids when they're all on their Christmas break and my day and Evie and Cody are here and all that sort of thing. So my goal today is to wrap at least these presents, at least. But I'm going to do that after I get back from town. So. All right, guys, it's like 10 to 9. I look so cool with my sunglasses on my hat, don't I? I got the truck and Kara and Mally and Violet are in there. <laughs> God. So, you know what kind of show that is? A shite show. And my mother in law called uh, to see if I can pick up some of that corn syrup that was 50% off yesterday. Wasn't even thinking, but she uses that. And I said, yeah, I will. So, I'm not really going in to buy a bunch of stuff. But I do have to walk around to get to where I'm going. So, you know, if I happen to see one or two things, I'll get them. Nope. All right. Oh, I can't go that way. What's going on here? I'll just check the bakery hodgepodge and work my way over to the other hodgepodge because that's where the corn syrup was yesterday. Oh. oh, there's some blueberry things. I am getting those. The kids really like them. And a chocolate chip one. Easy breakfast. Oh, that's those pizza things. Tracy, what are you doing? What are you doing? Should ya, should ya, should ya, should ya. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I should. All right. Oh, it smells like fish. I just passed the fish section. It's really stinky today. What is that? Steak. Some hamburg. 
extra lean. I've been using up my hamburger in the freezer, so. All right, Tracy, move your arse. Some sausages melt. Corn syrup, and I need butter, and I need eggs. I forgot that yesterday, too. So, I can't imagine all that corn syrup being gone. Is it? It was in a cart. Oh, well, there's two. There was a whole cart full. Well, she wanted four, but I might just be able to get her two, so that's better than... Oh, no, here. There. For my mummy, that one has stuff on the outside. Let me get a different one. All right, and when I was editing my video, tiki masala. Yeah. Ooh, that's good. Ooh, that's good. Okay. That's all, Tracy. That's all. That's all. Okay, I don't have time to lollygag and stuff, so let's just, oh, eggs, butter, Tracy. Eggs, butter. Oh, let's see. Oh, there's 18 packs for 5.29. they're not broke that'll be good enough and butter will be down here all right all right I dropped Mally and Kara now I'm at Sobeys to get Saritha's prescriptions Violet's out in the truck I assured her I'll be right back so she'll be fine I know I'm freaking out more than she is so I'll simmer down well, we made it to Papa's house. Uh, Saritha's prescriptions weren't ready, so. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I gotta go see where Papa is. I think he's in the basement. Well, I'm just waiting for 10 o'clock. And I'll run down and get that box. Dad must have been watching this. Yeah, he's watching BBC. He's just run down to the post office to check the post. And Violet's... There she is. There she is. You stay. You stay. All right. I'm down to nothing fancy furniture. Oh, this car's pulling in. It's just right there. And I'm going to get a big box. Oh. Just a minute, Violet. All right. We made it home. Gosh. So I got an upright freezer box. I put a four-wheeler ramp in there and a couple bags of my groceries. We've had bigger boxes, but we've had smaller boxes. But this will work. I'm excited. So I'm going to get Violet in the house get my groceries in the house and I'll see what I can do. All right guys, it's 10:52 and this is what I got at Superstore and then I'll show you what I got at the dollar store. Um I got two of the blueberry mini muffins and one of the chocolate chip. I got two of those little thin pizza crusts. We might have that tomorrow for supper. Um I got four packs of that hamburger, 11.29, 10.58. 1102 and 1071 but all 50% off this tiki masala sauce um 50% off I don't know what it is regular but got that and I got a salad tonight I'm gonna make chicken nuggets and french fries if you seen my video yesterday you seen I got that yesterday and they'll have salad to go along with it and I got some eggs so everything was 50% off well except for the eggs so not too bad, not a great big haul, but let me put this away and then I'll get out the Dollarama stuff. Oh, all right, not a whole bunch of stuff, but I got some labels because I plan on wrapping those presents today. 
I got a pair of scissors that'll stay with the wrapping stuff. I probably have some in my wrapping paper boxes, but I just, they were $1.25. Some tape, some tape, an extension cord, four things of, they're not the big heavy duty gloves, but they're not the little tiny rinky dink gloves uh, for the kids. Some more tape and Mosiah needed some white glue, something about slime, I don't know. And I got another tablecloth because I bought three yesterday. This is one of them, but I didn't see this one. So I'll change my tablecloths once a week. And yeah, we'll have some festive tablecloths. So yeah, I need to start wrapping because I'm feeling behind. All right, along with the presents that were brought downstairs, I got two of these. This is going to be for my niecey poo, that and a couple other little things. Um, these gift wrapping containers, violet, so there's a bunch of stuff in here and one under there. Oh, I'll look at that. Anyways, I just wanted to make sure that I had the stuff and I do. So now i got to pick a couple movies. All right, here's my Christmas movies. Ah, uh, I want to pick something light and easy violet oh i gotta sit down um violet skedaddle oh my god trailer park boys that's not so light i guess uh let's see last of the summer wine would be a good one tv's merriest episodes Mrs. Brown boys, I love those. Uh, Downton Abbey, Christmas, Mixed Nuts, I really like that one. Office Christmas Party, hmm. I don't know. Well, one I do like of the kids, they don't seem to care for it too much, is the snowman and his dog. There's two. And I have both of them. I don't know if this is the first one or not. But, um, I don't know. I'll find something and I'll show you. I think I'm going to do this one. It's TV episodes. Happy Days, Mork and Mindy, The Lucy Show, Laverne and Shirley, Petticoat Junction, The Beverly Hillbillies, Love American Style, The Odd Couple, and Cheers. Violet, what are you doing out there? How long is it? Oh, it's three hours and 37 minutes. It shouldn't take that long to wrap those presents, but who knows? So I'm going to put this in. The first one is Beverly Hillbillies, I think. All right. We'll try this on for size. Oh, and just so you know, I put the box right there. <laughs> Easier than trying to bring it in through the front door and all that stuff. Yeah, so what I'm going to do while that's booting up, I'm going to open these boxes and try to divide the presents, like Mally's presents, Misha's presents, Maze's presents, you know, in piles and tackle them one by one. Oh, that's the plan anyways. All right, there's Ma Maziah's, there's Misha's, there's Mally. Mally and Maziah don't have as much stuff as Misha and Maze here. But they have stuff coming, and their stuff is more pricey, if you know what I'm saying. So, yeah, it's Beverly Hillbillies. I'm going to start wrapping. Now, I'll have stuff blurred out just in case they ever see, but you'll know what I'm doing.
It's 107. This took a lot longer than I thought, but I have everything all wrapped that I had downstairs. Those tubs are chock a block a full. That big bag is. These are presents that the kids can wrap, like they're for other people, along with that little pile over there. Oh, what a mess, Violet. So I'm going to leave them right out because I know Misha really likes to wrap presents, so she can have at her, her and May's. Mazaya detests it. Mally, she's hit or miss. So, Marquise, he was home for lunch. And he'll bring the big tubs up later when he gets home. The kids won't touch them. I won't let them. But I will bring this up because this has, you know, I don't want them to see any of it. And, yeah. I will tidy up this mess, though. I'll put the paper back in here. I'll leave it downstairs, though, so... Um, yeah, but look at the aftermath, huh? <laughs> what a mess, Violet. I'm watching Laverne and Shirley Christmas. I made it through, let me see. I made it through the Beverly Hillbillies, the Lucy Show, Petty jo Coat Junction, Happy Days, and now I'm at Laverne and Shirley. So... Mork and Mindy, The Odd Couple, Cheers, and Love American Style. I don't know Love American Style, but, I mean, I'd watch it. Um, I don't know that one. Those are the ones that I have left. So if I don't get to them all today, I will finish this for sure. Because I'm enjoying it. You know, I really am. It's good. And they're all Christmas specials, so it's good. It's good. All right, friends, it's 2.07. I just emptied the ash bucket. I'm not usually the one that does it, but it needed emptying. I didn't put any firewood in this morning. It was cool enough, too, but I wanted to shovel out the stove because there's a lot of ash in there, and I didn't have any more room in the bucket. So I'm going to do that and get the fire going before the kids get home, and then I'll start working on supper. Now, I know there is still some hot coals in here, but there's just a lot. There's just a lot of ash. And I just want to get it. I'll take out the majority of this stuff.
I still got some kindling left in that box that I bought down to the store down the hill. So I'll throw some of that in on the bottom. It's not going to be hard. I don't want to take it all out because there is some, still some good coals here. But that's like more than half full. This thing I just emptied. paper here that was in one of those boxes I opened and that's perfect for starting a fire but I'm gonna go get some kindling I'll be right back all right I brought in the last little wood from the wood box just so now it's good and empty and I'll get the kids to fill it up when they get home I thought it was a cold stove I put the paper in on the bottom but I just don't want it to catch fire before I get the rest of the stuff in there. start itself once it starts smoldering a bit. I'm going to leave the door open just a, just a hair. Oh my god. Oh, for heaven's sakes. There. And the draft's open. And it should start. It should. 2.14, so. Oh, there. That's good. That's good. So, um, I'm going to empty the dishwasher. I started that this morning. I left it. That's done. I will um, dig out the pans and stuff for the fries and chicken nuggets and then that salad. That'll be easy to do up, but I won't start actually baking it until the kids get home. And then, yeah, we'll be good. Oh, I have Christmas jams pumping. Sleigh bells ringling, ring ting a ting a ling too. I just emptied, uh, or rotated the laundry. Dishwasher's empty. The fire still hasn't caught yet, but it's smoking, so it'll get going. And it's 2.28, so the kids will be here between 10 15. So I'll get these hung up and wait for the children. Oh, and I plugged the Christmas tree in. I was on the horn when the kids got home, but Mazaya, you need to shave. Huh? You need to shave. You got oh. a mustache. <laughs> you got a mustache, mate? Where did you guys grow facial hair? Mm. <laughs> you even got a unibrow. Yep. <laughs> it was mustache. Yeah, mustache day. Remember that one time like, when I had that sleepover with all my friends we were drawing? Yeah. Mm. So. All right. Get to work. Hustle. Hustle. Is there, is there a treat? There's supper. What's the supper one? Chicken nuggets treats? and fries and salad. I don't know. I'll see what I can find. Chips? French fries. Chips? I don't got no chips. I, I got French fries. I don't know. Get your boots on and hustle. Shake your booty, baby. All right. Yeah, I was talking to my husband on the phone. He's been on a waiting list to get a root canal, and he's been in excruciating pain. What? I'm going to get some of on. We'll put your jacket back on and do it. Where's your hoodie? Did you bring your hoodie home? Please tell me you brought your hoodie home. No. Well, you better bring it home tomorrow. And I didn't bring my gloves. All right. Hustle. 
yeah, he's had a toothache and his original appointment was December 21st. We got it bumped down to the 16th and I hassled, not hassled him. I squeaky wheel, right? Got it down to December 7th and then they called him this morning and they could take him this morning. So that's awesome. But root canals are expensive, expensive. And we have insurance. He still had to pay a hefty fee, but at least he can focus because a root canal or like any kind of super bad toothache is like a super bad earache. You can't do nothing. So that's good. I'm excited for him. Even though, God. Mace, what are you doing? Oh, sorry. Anyways, what I was popping back in for, um, when I was in town today, I stopped back and got Sarita's prescription. So when Messiah takes Violet out for a pee, I'll get Misha and Mace to bring over her prescriptions. Um, her insulin wasn't in it, so it didn't, it wasn't like she had to have it right away. And yeah, I got two pans out, lined them with this. I'll put a piece of parchment on top of that and I should preheat the oven, get off my butt and do something. Oh, they're down there fighting, but this is the French fries I'm using crispy skin on and I'm preheating the oven at 450. Oh, they're still working on the wood box, but the fire's kicked off, so that's good. The kids are done. All three of them, and Violet, went over to Saritha's to bring that over, so she'll get it. I'm sure she'll enjoy that little visit. They'll most likely come back with a few little candies, but that's normal. That's what Grammys do. She's not their Grammy, but, you know, it's, it's what she does. <laughs> so, anyways, I'm just waiting for that oven to come up. French fries are right there on that bench. I'm gonna get those in before I do the nuggets because those take longer than the nuggets. But yeah. Actually, Maze was the messenger boy and he came over because Saritha's asleep and she's deaf in one ear so she wouldn't hear them. So I went over and I put it on the kitchen table along with an Amazon package. I don't know, three. All right. No head bonking. Um, there's presents here that need to be wrapped. You if anybody, can you not put your there. Right there, there. Are those muffins? Yeah, there was just a few of those ones. Well, go. Yes, you need to put your muffin wrappers in the garbage. Because Violet will eat them. Yeah. She will eat them. She doesn't care if they're wrappers or muffins. They're still yeah. Mm. Why? So put them out on the dining room table, hun. Like where she can't jump up and get them. Boxes. None of your beeswax. Presents? Are they no. Books? Yeah. Yes, books. they're all books. It's, I knew it because there was a box of books right there. No. They're all for they're me. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Nope. They're presents. Nope. Yeah. No, Misha. Those are books. Yeah, as I opted out of it, but oh. it's okay. Do you want me to get the paper ready for you, Maze? It's fine. It's fine. I'll show you. All right. This is a pack and a half of those jeans. Uh, chicken nuggets. Oh, they're looking good. Kara's even joining the party. Look at that maze. Evie's going to love that present. Oh, Misha. Those are better wrapped than mine. All those clean lines and everything. I, uh... <laughs> I just kind of throw it together and make it stick. No. There's more paper, bub. What? That part That's all right. So this was one of the presents for Evie, and Maze did a fantastic job. We'll get a sticker and put it on there, taped it all the way around. Good job. You got good cutting skills. Look at that. Woo! <laughs> Nellie's home. Want some assistance? Yes, it will. All right. Violet. Chicken nuggets. Fries. Salad. Ooh, it's a circus. It's a circus.
right. And that's how we do it, Violet. That's how we do it. There's a plate in the microwave for Marquise when he gets home. And there's some salad left. I'll probably put in their lunches tomorrow. And we can use the rest for supper, whatever we have. But my dishwasher's darn near empty, so I can load this up and have an easy, quick cleanup. Oh, dang it. I just got done cleaning up the kitchen. I came out here, and there's deers across the road in that yard. <coughs> I was trying to catch them. Oh, it's still there. Walking in the driveway. Oh, the bush is in the way, Violet. Don't you dare start barking. Don't you dare. Can I see it over here? Oh, it's coming over to our yard. Violet. It's a little doe. Well, not little, like teenager. Don't often just see one. Baby, you better find some place to hide, darling. You looking for your mama? I don't dare move, because even though I'm in a dark room. Oh. Violet hasn't seen it yet. She knows I'm looking at something. Oh, she sees it. Oh, there's two. Good. Oh, Jesus. Jeepers. <laughs> Violet, simmer down. And there's Marquise, just getting home. <laughs> oh, there's three. <laughs> Violet, simmer down. We're not hurting nobody. Oh, you this. <laughs> God, here they go. Violet's having a cow, for goodness sakes. You scared him away. That's Marquise. He's about to turn in. I'll get his supper heated up. Look. Oh, he's keep... I'm sure that's Marquise. Oh, he's probably trying to scare him away so they don't go in the road. Maybe that wasn't Marquise. Or maybe he's going down to the store. What are you doing, Marquise? Yeah, I think he's just following them to make sure they get somewhere safer than right there. Anyways, yeah, I got the kitchen cleaned up. I didn't turn the dishwasher on, but got this mess cleaned up again. I'm going to vacuum tomorrow. I'm not tonight. I got a book right there to finish tonight. I'm determined to finish it tonight. A couple hundred pages this evening. I'll be good. That pile of books there is what I read this month. And I want to do a monthly wrap-up tomorrow if I can on my book channel. So, anyways, I'm going to leave these downstairs. I'll just put them, I won't leave them right here. Just because I will have more wrapping, but that was a significant, significant amount done. And the kids wrapped the rest of the stuff that I had, that pile that was right there, all wrapped. So, <laughs> She's still, she's still, you scared him away. I should turn this lamp on and shut the blinds there. They're gone. Oh, you're such a good guard dog. If anything, she's a fantastic alarm system. Anybody comes to the house or even touches the stinking doorknob. You can guarantee she's going to make a noise. So. All right. Yeah, that's Marquis coming in the house now. But uh, I just came upstairs. Mazai came home with some forms to sign. I guess they're starting skateboarding at school, and I have to give permission. So that's pretty cool. Oh, I should tell him his food's ready. Yeah, that was Marquis in the van. Um... Anyways, yeah, he had a good day at work. He's just heating up his plate. He'll have that. The kids are in Marquise's room painting some of those sea rocks they brought home when the kids went for a walk with Natasha, my sister-in-law, the other day, last weekend, or last week. 
their painting. So that's good. I'm going to end this video now um, so I can kick back the rest of the evening after. It's very festive feeling now. I have music still playing. We had music all while we ate and wrapped presents and chaos ensued, but that's the way it goes with families. Good chaos, but chaos all the same. So anyways, I do plan on filming tomorrow and I'm feeling very accomplished about those presents. Violet, the moose. And yeah, it was good to get a jump on that. So now I can move on to maybe doing my fridge tomorrow. I really don't want to. I'm hating, dreading that. But if I just do it and get it over with, I'll feel a hundred times better. And then I want to super deep clean the upstairs bathroom because dad's already asked me, when, when do you want to do that bathroom, Trace? I'm thinking, yesterday, but I'm not ready for it yet. <laughs> but uh, anyways, anyways, that's just life. That's life. So, so anyways, I'm going to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose. But if not, that's okay too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So, oh, and while I was at Dad's today, I didn't have time to do it today. I want to sit down and have a cup of tea with you because I got a couple cards in the mail. So we'll open those. Is he going to come up? If Marquis ever comes up, he always says something inappropriate just to be funny. I'll do this quick. So with that, I'm going to say have a good night or have a good morning. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Boink.